and Dr. Keith Ablo with another pain to power video. This one is about a uh, gym called Creativity, uh, G-Y-M, called Creativity. Uh, it's about exercising your core and I'm just using it as a metaphor because what I want to urge people to do in order to become more powerful uh, is simply to create. Every day if you can, but say if it were three or four days a week, even two or three days a week, if you give yourself time to express yourself creatively, whether it's through poetry or writing fiction or taking up a pencil and drawing uh, or uh, using paint, painting canvases, creating art, whatever it is, you don't have to judge it. You don't have to sell it. It doesn't have to receive critical acclaim. This is an exercise essentially for your core, just like you'd go to the gym and exercise your core at the gym. The center of folks uh, is very much involved with their creative spirit. It's a gift. And when you start using that, you get stronger. You get stronger. Because in life, there are so many things that influence you to not be yourself. But inside you is a reservoir of creative energy. Ideas, uh, business ideas even. Those are creative. New ideas for products. That's the same in a way as a painting, creating a painting. This comes from inside of you. And all the events in your life that may have led you to say, oh yeah, I can't go in this direction, I can't go in that direction, this thought isn't exactly mine. This is a way of centering yourself again because it can be a very, very pure form of energy. So if it's going to be journaling, pick up that journal. Do it daily if you can. If it's going to be poetry, great. If it's going to be thinking about ideas, all the better. But set aside some time to do it because you're exercising your core, the person that you were meant to be. It's still there. And if you've gone some distance from it, and in that distance, anxiety uh, or low mood has uh, become a reality for you, uh, this is a way to bring yourself back towards center. Uh, the antidote to anxiety and low mood and sleeplessness is very often reconnecting with the core. That's where the strength comes from. And creativity is a wonderful pathway to do just that.